Well, I think what we have to do, the, Bill, the first day is to uh, is to feel it out as we uh, we're going we're going to have to find out what the mood is. Uh, we have, want to find out whether whether uh, the mood might be on the basis of their statement they made a couple of days ago, or it might be they may have said that. Now they may say something else. And I want to feel naturally there'll be in the in the plenary sessions. We'll have every we'll have our every all our interpreters there, but uh, I do not want to have a situation, say, where I'm in, a, in what is basically a very private meeting with him, where I'm bringing where there are extra people there. My but, experience has been that these times are really illustrative. They. Yeah. They let it run. The difficulty is that that day we have a plenary session and we have a dinner. Don't we? Yeah, but they have postponed the dinner. Yeah. I've never seen them pay any attention. But they always start on the second. I mean, there's right. never, they're never late. You can start on the second and end on the hour. But, uh, but I think they, again, just judging by my October trip. They'll get it done in two hours in the plenary session because you'll make a statement, he'll make a statement, and there'll be some general agreement on how to proceed. This is most interesting with the Chinese. Uh, your comments before about Mao and Joe and uh, Mal Rose anti memoirs are most interesting. You know? Yeah, and read the first part too. Uh, it's talk about uh, really the more interesting part is his evaluation of the Gaulle. It's, uh, it's rather fascinating. sort of a montage of the of the leaders as they stood on the platform. So you go gling, 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 one after another. Then it'll, that'll be fascinating. 